Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Metalhead Reacts. Now, today we have one that was actually requested by a few people. Um, it is Khan, I think that's how you say it, um, with the song Concepts. Now, this was recommended by... Sorry, trying to read my handwriting. A fam. New... N-Y-V-E? What does that spell? Everyone. Never everyone. And Ethan Harrison. <laughs> um, now, this one had 2.2 million views on YouTube. So quite a bit. Never heard of Khan before. Um, completely foreign to me. Haven't even heard of the dude's name. So, excited. Hopefully, well, this got... A few comments. I might have missed a few people that recommended it. I did see it pop up, but I couldn't find your comments again. Sorry. So if I missed anyone, my bad. Before we do get started, I would just like to point out that I apologize for wearing a Justice Justice League shirt. I'm definitely more of a Marvel fan. Um, Christmas present. But don't get me wrong. I, I liked uh, I like Batman. Like the the three that Christian Bale did. And like Tom Hardy is Bane and shit like that. But other than that, Marvel all the way. Marvel Universe, baby. All right. Enough chat. Let's do this. The psychotic episode. I need my medication. Hyperventilating, about to have a panic attack in public. Discussing this with the publicist while I'm meditating. All I spit this heat, so is this room probably ventilated? I'm killing your hide away. I'm on the track. I never relax. You feel like you fucking with me on my floor, but you is on my nigga. That shit is a rap. So playing a relevant back. I'm taking a beat and I'm giving it back. I'm putting that right in your face. Oh, good pick. Rehearsing, disperse a curse. That's a mercy for certain. I've been conversing, confirming this, you're in that bad. I can only describe this as tight. And my persuasive perversion was a diversion of sugar while I'm emerging. Concerning my love that baseline, man. Oh god, I hope this guy signed. Oh. Oh, I love it. This guy just has every one of them fucking views, man. Triplets, baby! Oh yeah. It's almost got like that Cypress Hill vibe, like instrumentation. I'm loving it. Is it Cypress Hill? Yeah, I think it is. Have I not heard this guy before, man? Fuck yeah. Oh, you know it's good when it's mad. <laughs> Oh. I actually love this guy's vocabulary too. He's actually rapping with some good fucking words and making some solid fucking rhymes. Oh, 
I'm trying to figure out when he breathes. Oh, fuck yes! Oh, man! I shall leave you as you left me. As you left her. My room for all eternity. Abstract aren't coming soon, okay. On the dead planet. Buried alive. Buried alive. <laughs> I like that. God, that's cool. That's you know. I like that. He's got some fucking retro vibes going on, man. I fuck that was fucking sick. Honestly, good pick. Like that was so purely rap. Because you guys are usually giving me like this metal or like influence stuff. Like that was cool as shit. Man, his articulation, his point on his vocabulary, his fucking rhymes, Jesus, man, fucking rhythms. He was doing some fucking cool triplets in the middle there and then some, like, hard, staggered, like, offbeat fucking articulation. Fuck yeah, man. That was, that was solid. Fucking massive thumbs up. Love the retro vibe going on as well. That Cypress Hill, I'm pretty sure it's Cypress Hill I'm thinking of in my head that does like that. Yeah, it is. It is Cypress Hill I'm thinking of. Fuck yeah, honestly. Video, um, pretty sure that was like not a big production video. That was just him and a camera and they just mixed that together. That was still cool as shit, cool location and cool shots they did. Fuck yeah. God, I hope he is signed. Because he he has some fucking talent, man. Fuck yeah. And he, I feel like he's filling a hole like for those, um, Oh, I was going to say, like, the golden oldies of rap that are gone now. No one's sort of filling that hole or keeping that side of the genre going. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Again, massive thumbs up. Thank you to AFAM, everyone, and Ethan Harrison for the recommendation. And until next time, motherfuckers, rock on.